Hi guys, it's Paula. Welcome to my channel. Today I will do something that I missed doing <laughs> but I used to do quite a bit of when I was so based in Manila and that is talking about handbags. It dawned on me recently that the brand that I have the most items from is Loewe and I don't regret it uh, but I thought I'd share with you my Loewe collection. Not gonna get into specifics. I will refer to my notes and I will do this in, at least I'll try to do this in chronological order. From the first bag that I got up to the newest one, at least the new to me one. The very first bag that I ever picked up from Loewe is this mini puzzle bag. So I made a detailed video on this maybe three years ago. Oh god, three years ago, that was such a long time ago. And I do love this bag, but I have sold this to a good friend of mine. I'm just keeping it for her until she gets to pick it up personally in Tokyo in a few months. But because it's still here, I thought I'd include it. So this was the very first Loewe piece that I ever got. This is the mini puzzle bag in light blue from 2019. And this comes with a strap that is not adjustable. If you want a more detailed video about this bag, I will post the link somewhere on the screen as well as down below in the description box. I really love this. I got a lot of use out of it. Fits quite a lot. But I have somewhat stopped using smaller bags of late. So when my friend asked if I was interested in rehoming this, I took that as a sign from the universe that it was time to rehome it. This is the mini puzzle bag in light blue with palladium hardware. Also, this piece came from Loewe in Rustans or SSI in Manila. So the only store that they used to have was in Shangri-La. But if I'm not mistaken, they have since opened one in Greenbelt. The second bag that I picked up from Lueve is this horseshoe bag with the strap. I just detached it. So this one is the horseshoe with palladium hardware and the colorway is midnight blue and wine. I also posted a video about this. I think the unboxing plus importation process <laughs> of this bag. But I got this directly from the Loewe website when they had a sale, I would say in 2021. Yes, I think in 2021. And this came directly from Spain. I love this bag also, but I have not been getting a lot of use out of it. I don't know if it's just because of the season or because I do have other bags that I tend to gravitate towards but I love it and I don't intend to let it go sorry if it's dusty inside it's just like one big compartment with no pockets so again this is the horseshoe bag I think they have since discontinued this bag now not long after I picked up the horseshoe bag, I got this bag <laughs> from SSI, well Loewe under SSI in Shangri-La, Philippines. And I have to refer to my notes because I don't want to be inaccurate. This is the mini top handle gate with gold hardware and in the colorway icy pink. I did a more comprehensive like unboxing video of this one and I love this bag. This comes with a strap. This comes with a strap that's not adjustable, but it's quite okay. For reference, I am 5'3". Falls like this. I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe I should walk a little farther out. Yeah. I love this bag. I really love this bag. I've gotten a lot of use out of it. I do tend to use it during warmer seasons. So this one has one big compartment, a slip pocket in front, another slip pocket the back but this is really really spacious i love this bag never getting rid of it i think it's the perfect size this is the mini fits a lot and no color transfer <laughs> despite me having used it you know with denim with black clothes it's pristine so i love i love this bag i really love this bag if you know me in real life you would know that in as much as i try to take care of my bags i'm not really that fussy with them so the fact that this pink bag has survived the test that is myself <laughs> it says a lot about the quality of this bag 
And then the next bag that I got was this. And I really, really love this bag. Again, I have to be very particular. This is the Surplus Project Woven bag. Even before I moved here to Tokyo, my mom and I had been eyeing this bag just because of, well, I know it's advertising, <laughs> but I will link that video down below in the description box. Essentially, Loewe came out with the short video of how they make this woven bag out of surplus leather. And this one comes from the surplus leather line. I got this here in Tokyo in May of 2022. And this was a gift from my mom, my moving to Tokyo gift. And the backstory with this was I've always wanted, and I guess to a certain extent, I still do want the basket bag. And I was actually going to get one already. I was in Isetan in Shinjuku. And again, I had that basket bag in my hand and I was going to pay for it. And then I looked to the side and then I saw this bag on display. It was easy to miss because they had like, I'll include a video uh, somewhere in the screen of like the ones that were on the main display. This one was quite hidden. I don't know if that was on purpose, but the colorways that they had available, you know, on display were not the colors that I was kind of interested in. So when I saw this neutral one, I was like, wait, I need to take a look at it. Essentially what happened was I let go of that basket bag. So to this day, I still don't have a basket bag and got this instead. I really love this bag. So one big compartment and then you have this piece of leather that can be used as support with the webbe there. It comes with a strap, which is not adjustable. I generally leave the strap on when I use this because it's an open bag. If I want my things to be more secure, what I do is I use the dust bag that they've provided and then that's where I put all my things. I'm very lucky to have found this colorway when I did because I was just about to buy something else. Earlier this year for my birthday, my mom got me this bag. We got this pre-loved from Second Street in Shinjuku. This is the, let me consult my notes, Paula 2020 Ibiza. That's how you pronounce it, right? <laughs> or Ibiza? Ibiza? Ibiza. <laughs> the Paula 2020 Ibiza Beach Tote. It's just a summer bag. I haven't had the chance to use it because it's been raining. Like the weather has really been weird this summer. But it looks like this. This is made out of beads. The bottom is like this, and then you have the lower bay anagram here, and it's just one big compartment. And then you have like a pocket that's like velcroed, it didn't really secure it, but essentially you can tie the extra fabric so that you have a cover at the top. So this was one of my mom's gifts to me on my birthday uh, earlier this year. Before we go to the last piece, I thought I'd do really quickly a run through of the small leather goods that I own from Loewe. The first one is this wallet. This is a coin zip with a lot of coins. <laughs> I think I did like a dedicated unboxing for this wallet maybe two years ago or even three years ago. I got this from Stan's SSI Loewe store in Shangri-La in the Philippines. This has a longer strap that you can like attach to any of your bags at, or like a d-ring but i don't know where i placed it it's it's somewhere it's somewhere there so this is the first small leather good that i have from loewe and then i also have like a continental style wallet they're kind of matching okay so it's just like a simple wallet with 12 card slots like a zip pocket in the middle, two main compartments, and then slip pockets. And then the third small leather good that I have is this one. I also have a dedicated video unboxing this. I think. I think I do. Actually, I think I unboxed these three together like a couple of years ago. But if I find it, I'll link it down below in the description box if you're interested. This one came from the Studio Ghibli Loewe collaboration. This was from the second year which is spirited away. The only year that I managed to get anything, this is the card the holder with the susuwateri. One main compartment with four card slots. I use this extensively for like two years. You can see that it's 
clearly been loved. Never letting this go because I love Studio Ghibli. I love Spirited Away. It's not my ultimate favorite, but it's in my top five. Second to the last, <laughs> a small other good that I have from Loewe. This is just a card holder with a small like coin compartment in the middle. But I got this March of last year from Loewe Seibu in Ikebukuro during their 50th I think it was the 50th anniversary yeah it might have been the 50th anniversary but I only started using it this year this is in the this really gorgeous like green colorway with selenium hardware and it has that donut strap as the card holder the most recent piece not new but new to me is this large puzzle bag selenium hardware and in this gorgeous gorgeous like chocolate brown uh colorway now this is an older model and i think this is actually from the men's line because it's massive uh it still has its feet sign that it's an older model this has been my everyday bag for the last month actually because i just got it last month and this is also why i decided to rehome my mini puzzle bag because I don't really need two of the same thing, right? Even if they're different sizes. So yes, I love this bag. Massive. An issue though with bigger bags is that me, I tend to like overstuff bags that are bigger. But I love how slouchy this is. The zip pocket, which is where I put like my wallet sometimes or my key holder or even my phone because it fits quite a lot. Most of the time, I do use it as a shoulder bag. So just like this handbag is not alone it has this elephant charm that i also picked up last month it doesn't fit my airpods <laughs> so it's really just a charm you can put like coins in it and whatnot but there's nothing in it at the moment this is the large puzzle bag i'm not sure what the colorway is but it's in this gorgeous gorgeous brown with palladium hardware so that's it thank you for bearing with me and my silliness if you have any questions about any of the bags that i showed you today please do comment it down below and i'll try my best to answer them thank you thank you for bearing with me i really enjoyed talking about handbags thank you for watching and until next time bye